Liverpool will not be put off by a £17 million release clause in Ruben Amarim's contract at Sporting Lisbon in their search for Jurgen Klopp's successor, according to reports. The Reds are in the process of picking a new manager ahead of next summer after Klopp announced on Friday that he will be leaving the club in the summer. His decision has already led to rumors about where the German could end up next season, while there is speculation as to who Liverpool could bring in as his replacement ahead of next season. Xabi Alonso has emerged as early favourite with the bookmakers with the former Liverpool midfielder doing a brilliant job at Bayer Leverkusen, who are currently unbeaten in top of the Bundesliga table. Portuguese newspaper Correio da Manhã does name Alonso as one of the names on the Reds' shortlist to succeed Klopp, alongside Steven Gerrard, Julian Nagelsmann, and Thomas Frank. But it is sporting Lisbon boss Almerim who they concentrate their efforts on with the Portuguese coach already linked to the Premier League on a number of occasions in the past. Read more. Klopp is just more in you without the success and Liverpool should make hilarious in reappointment. The report insists that the 38-year-old is ready for higher goals after his success at Sporting and Correio de Manha claims his €20 million, Euros, £17 million pounds, release clause in his contract won't be an impediment for Liverpool. Steve McMenamin was one of a number of former Liverpool players who reacted publicly to Klopp's announcement on Friday with the ex-Real Madrid winger insisting it was a decent time to reveal the news. McMenamin told TNT Sports, like most people, it was a big shock. I didn't expect Jurgen to be around for the next 5 or 10 years, but whenever the announcement happens, whether it's at the start, middle or end of the season, it would have been a shock given what the Liverpool fans think of him and what he's done for the club. I don't think there's any right time to announce an announcement like this. But a couple of days after they got to Wembley and they're sitting pretty in four competitions, if there's ever a time when it's going to be a little bit more softened, it's probably now. McMenamin added, it's hard because Bill Shinkley started things, Bob Paisley followed on and was incredibly successful. Then Joe Fagan and Kenny Dalglish came in. They were all successful in their own right. It's hard to say that he's certainly in the conversation. As long as you're successful with Liverpool, and add a trophy to contribute to the history of success, you'll be spoken about in lofty terms. With Jurgen and the charisma of the man, that's what people latched onto and appreciate. Vocally, someone like him and Bill Shankly stand out. Bob Paisley and Kenny Dalglish were a lot quieter. Whereas Jurgen is outspoken and passionate, and I think he's certainly regarded as one of the best.